No chance. Jason Alexander poked fun at Megan as she insisted on Julia Roberts' role in Pretty Woman Part 2. Sources said that after the failure of not being able to make the list of Emmy nominations this year, Megan was extremely upset. The Duchess not only contacted Kevin Costner to join the Bodyguard remake, but she also expressed her desire to play Vivian Ward in Pretty Woman Part 2. Pretty Woman is one of the most quintessential romances in movie history. It's been decades since the premiere, but fans still swoon over Edward Lewis, Richard Gere falling hard for Vivian Ward, Julia Roberts, and both of them learning so much in the process. Plenty of films have taken inspiration from Pretty Woman, but so far that hasn't been a sequel. That would explain what exactly happened after Edward the Knight rescued Vivian from a tower, so to speak. Plenty of films have taken inspiration from Pretty Woman, but so far there hasn't been a sequel that would explain what exactly happened after Edward the Knight rescued Vivian from a tower, so to speak. Pretty Woman was a major success at the box office and earned several award nominations despite some mixed reviews from critics. And people still love the movie 30 years on, all because of those tweaks to the script. There's a tendency in Hollywood to revisit nostalgic material and try to make it better. But coster Jason Alexander says remaking Pretty Woman just wouldn't be the same. Let's see, I'm 61. I don't want to even guess how old the rest of the cast is, but I'm not sure it's quite the same sparkle now as it did back in 1990. When asked by a reporter if the Sussex Duchess is likely to take on the role of Vivian, Alexander honestly replied, I see no possibility of that happening at all. In theory, A Pretty Woman Part 2 seems like a good idea, but it's probably better to just imagine Edward and Vivian lived happily ever after. Back in 2017, Markle made a list of all the women who positively impacted her life including Mama Doria Raplin. Lo and behold, it was Roberts that inspired Megan to plunge headfirst into the wild world of Hollywood. She was the first person I saw on screen and thought, that looks like so much fun. I want to do that, she wrote. When I was younger, someone once told me, you kind of look like Julia Roberts. It was the best compliment I've ever had. The Oscar winner is built a successful career in Hollywood as a leading lady, most notably in the R.O.M. com genre, which sadly she won't be making anymore. Even though Megan didn't make it to the Emmy Award, she still worked hard to imitate Roberts' style and mannerisms. The Duchess also recently expressed her desire to produce a romantic R.O.M. com following in Julia's footsteps, but Netflix hasn't yet approved the request. Reflecting on Megan's more friendly, relatable, and fun appearance in the interview, a body language expert has explained that the Duchess was channeling Julia Roberts in the last video. According to body language expert Juvie James, the four-minute clip shows a range of Megan's on display as she giggled and performed self-heckling facial expressions reminding viewers of Roberts and pretty woman James said sweet, cute, coy, self-effacing. Megan channeled Roberts and appeared from the cheesy mom to the elegant model.